the next alternative to Obamacare that I want to talk about, because it wasn't mentioned, wasn't a part of the law that we call the Affordable Health Care Act, but it's what I will refer to as regulatory reform. You see, most people think that with Obamacare, somehow the government took over the health care industry. <laughs> That's a joke. The government already had full control over insurance, doctors, hospitals, every drop of health care through laws and things we call regulations, rules, procedures, whatever. And the list gets into the quadzillions. I mean, it's just crazy. And most of them, well, maybe I shouldn't say most, but many of them, are redonkulous. They should be repealed, cut out, dropped immediately. And to say that these regulations don't cause the cost of health care to skyrocket, again, you must be nuts. Let me give you just one example. Do you remember back in the late 1990s when Congress passed that law? We call it HIPAA, H-I-P-P-A, I think, or P-A-A. Uh, I think it's Health Insurance Private you know, act or something like that. I'll never forget when that passed because I went to the doctor, actually to a hospital to have a, some blood work done. And instead of when it was my turn, I had to register, but when it was my turn, they could not say, Mr. Watson, please come forward. Uh, they couldn't say anything because of this new act. So they gave me this little thing you get at a restaurant, you know, the red lights that go around and it, it vibrates in your hand. And I thought how ridiculous this is because I'm here with my face and my entire body, but yet they're not going to say my name? Hey, that's what happens when government is in charge of everything. Those kind of ridiculous regulations. You know, I could go on and on. And by the way, HIPAA alone, just that one law that passed, it cost every single hospital in America, many of them millions of dollars. And certainly overall, it was into the tens of billions of dollars because every hospital had to become compliant with this new law and all this privacy stuff. And I know you're still hearing about it. Again, please tell me, please try to justify those regulations and say it's worth the cost. Or even more so, tell me that it did not raise the cost of health care. If your local hospital had to pay a million, two million, ten million dollars to make their systems compliant with this law, you're telling me they didn't have to raise some prices to get that covered? Of course they did. So I'd love for a congressman to have the guts to stand up and just make a law where he or she lists hundreds, thousands of who knows how many regulations, sits down with healthcare professionals to come up with a lot of these re regulations that do nothing but just bog the system down, that don't help with healthcare, and causes the whole system to cost more. That would be a great thing to do and something Obamacare did not touch. Believe me, there are, are alternatives to Obamacare. I've got more coming.